Hey guys, Chaotic Confusion here, and welcome back to Hue. I haven't actually played this in a while, so I thought I'd come back and uh, see about recording another episode of it. Um, it is kind of an interesting game, so I just wanted to kind of see where the where the story is heading. So uh, we will see about getting back into this, if I can remember how to play, since it's been a while since I've done anything with it. I think I, if I remember from last time I played this, that there are certain colors you do not want to change this right away because then that uh, blue laser or whatever comes across and kills you. Hopefully. Alright. I was thinking maybe you could actually like fall down that. I mean you can obviously fall down it but I was thinking that you could like there's something else down there I guess. Obviously, you don't want to use red because that's going to drop me in. Oh yeah, duh. Okay. Hmm. Light blue. I was trying to figure out what was actually opening the gates, but I realized it's the little circuit pathway things that the lasers hit now. Kind of confused before as to how all of that was working. Alright. Oh, that's nothing. Okay. That one to take off the yellow. I don't know if I really need to drag that back, but I'm going to. what I was trying to hit. Thinking thing. Let's try not to die to our own stupidity this time. Okay, so that one... That. So I did need this. Like spikes. That wasn't so bad. Oh, 
fairly certain that I cannot jump over there without hitting it. I can't even jump that far. Yeah. Not exactly sure what to do. The only way I know how to get the uh, box down so I can actually grab the key to make those balloons disappear. Oh, I guess I can. Oh, I should be able to write this back up. I can't really do that because I'm going to hit the lasers. Okay, there we go. Okay. Now we can make that one fall down. Ooh. Almost got squished. Don't wanna be squished. I was going about that in totally the wrong way. I realize that now. I'm willing to admit when I'm being an idiot. Kind of switching back and forth between these. That wasn't so bad. This one doesn't... Um... Oh. I see. Oh. Definitely. All right. So I just need to get over there and change the color to thing. Oh, it red, red. Again. Um. Red. Thank you. Okay, so that one went back up. Okay, so that one actually is two on that. button. Actually, I was supposed to hit this, the uh, tr the um, joystick and not a button at all, so that was less than helpful.
That's close. All right. Oh, Thumb Dude is back. Hey, Thumb Dude. Always just with the turning and walking away. Why? Oh, this is my last color. Green. Last color. I remember. Is this the last? Yes. Okay, so I actually have all of them now. It goes through all the colors. It's so pretty. Was it just going to keep doing that? I'd rather it not. Can you can you not? Oh. Don't look at the sun. Orange, pink, red, even yellow and green. Great fireworks played out across the backdrop to my reality. Was I dreaming? Did I lie? My senses dulled from a lifetime of monotone, struggled with revelation. Time oozed. Colors danced in slow motion. Painting a ballet on the moon. I removed the ring and time slipped back to normal. Color dissolved into gray. It was overwhelming. But what followed affected me the most. After seeing in color for the first time, when everything returned to normal, I could remember in color. I had never before had a colored memory. Makes sense. How can you remember something you've never actually seen? Like... Like what they say, you know, how do you describe uh, the color green to a person who's been blind their whole life, you know? There's just no way you can actually... No way you can actually do that. At least the color isn't permanently changing this time. That was kind of annoying. Other color. There we go. I wonder how close I am to the inn then. Of course, they usually give you a little bit to do with the colors after you get them. I need to go up there and get it. Yeah. What is this? Oh, just shutting that part off. Gotcha. Alright. I have to feel at least a little bit like I must be getting closer to these if I have all the colors. I have no idea what I'm actually.
He was trying to figure out how to, uh... Get a box down there to stand. Or something. I don't know why. Because I have to back of actually hit. Oh, 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 okay. I know what I'm doing now. I realize my issues. Well, I don't know. I, I always realized my issues, I guess, but I realized what I was supposed to do with the box now. Now I get it. Gotcha. That right. That is what I'm supposed to do. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. I really like these laser things. Oh, gotcha. Good. Good. That one off first. Then. Yellow off. Orange. I guess that's orange. Calling the orange yellow again. I'm gonna have to wait for it to come back. I didn't follow it fast enough. Just have to be careful this time. Wait for it. Wait for it. Try not to shave my hair off with the uh, laser. Who oh, made it? Success. Boxy boy. My boxy boy over here. Have anything? Oh. No. F2. Dude, do I have to push that stupid box back over here with that thing still running? Huh. Wait, how would I do that though? Can I can't get up to the lever that way. Push that all the way over there with the stupid. I don't want to. Ha ha ha! I got you, block. I just have to wait for it to come back so I can actually jump up and get the key, and then I have to do it all over again and hopefully not get hit by any laser. We can do that, right? Sure. All right, I got the key. I am. Made it! Success! I guess technically I have to let that come back, don't I?
I suppose it would have made a lot more sense just to stop the stupid platform over on the, uh... ...side over there. So, yes, I'm sure there's many people watching this going, Why didn't you just do that? And that's because I didn't think of it until right this very moment. And then I went, well, duh. Well, that's a good reason, isn't he, right? Alright. Well, that gets us through a few more rooms in Hue. Still don't know a lot about what's, uh... What's going on with the story, or a lot more about it yet. But, uh... And it's... Unfortunately, it's still blazing hot in my room. This recording room that I use. Which sucks! I think it's like 90, 95 degrees in here right now. The little thermometer that I'm using is not, uh... Doesn't really go much past like 83, 83 or 85 or something like that. It's not te technically a room thermometer. But just on how far the needle's going past the, the 80 something mark, I'm guessing it's probably around 90 to 95 in here. <laughs> it's too hot! I can't stay in here recording as long as I'd like to, but at least we got a few more rooms done, so uh, hopefully we'll be able to soon see what uh, what's going on with the story, I guess, and uh, not sure how much longer is left in this. I actually have no idea how long this game is supposed to be in. I'm sure I'm going through it a lot slower than what it's meant to be, just because I don't always, like if I run through and, uh, you know, like the parts that I had to redo or whatever, if I have to redo any of the parts and I'm not actually, you know, talking to the camera or whatever, I go through them much faster if I'm trying to, like, actually think about talking and, you know, actually doing the let's play things, the, you know, doing let's play stuff, and talking and paying attention, then I'm not, uh, I can't focus totally on the game and it's making it a, uh, lot harder for me to get stuff done or get it done accurately or think through it correctly. My mind is trying to think of too many things at once. It doesn't always work as well as it should, but that's okay. But, uh, yep, so I guess I am going to leave this episode of Hugh here. Um, I do appreciate any of you who are watching these videos. I know right now, as of this recording, there's really not much... I mean, I get a few views here and there, but not really much of anybody watching it, but, uh... You know, in case anybody in the future does decide to actually watch these videos, or stumbles across them, or what have you, I want to thank you for, uh, giving these videos a chance, you know, uh, having a look at my channel and everything, and, uh... We will, uh... Not sure what I'm going to be uploading yet for my next one after this. I've got several series kind of going at once here, so I have to decide which one I want to uh, actually do next. But uh, I appreciate you all watching the videos, like I said, and I hope to see you in a future video.